Hey, it's Roman Deer Park Farmstead. Rented this awesome newer Kubota excavator and man, I did some damage out back. So cleared a bunch of trees, pushed them over. I'll show you what I did. Uh, but yeah, also cleaned up the front here. I'll show you that. The wife and I have been getting these pine needles here. But yeah, I limbed all these trees and mowed the front here. So it looks a little more cleaner up front. It was looking a little overgrown, needed a nice trim. So got all that. The cherry tree looks really nice. But uh, yeah, I still have to get my, my other tractor out here and you know, grab these and put them out back the pile that we have collecting that I'm gonna burn. So let's go check out the other stuff I did. So, Basil over here. She's been having a tough time because she's without her mom now. So we have sugar with her though and kind of keeping her company, so that's nice. Poor thing, she lost her voice. She's been crying. She's kind of calming down, kind of getting used to it now. So we've been paying a lot more attention to her, making sure she's comfortable and trying her best anyways. Poor thing. She's hanging in there though right now. Normally she's really loud when we come up. We've got some tomato plants in here. Our neighbor gave us some more, so We'll be planting a lot of tomato plants and some greens here. I'm going to get some arugula planted pretty soon here. Uh, my wife found a strawberry right there on the left side over here. And so she's keeping that strawberry plant. Right over here on the right side, our friends actually gave us some spools, but um, on the right side, those are the old trees that I had uh, pushed over from the last time I had the excavator and these are some new ones here on this side I, I downed some trees up front here and then there's some more up here there's another pile down trees this is all normally all completely shaded right here normally all these trees are all down so I'm able to get some sun up here I gotta we're gonna burn all these pallets here and uh, you know, I don't know I'm gonna perhaps cut these log make these into you know wood and perhaps sell it we'll see just gotta kind of clean these branches up and then I'll cut these all into shorter logs Still another pile over here. I need to enclose these guys really quick <laughs> over here. But I pushed all these over here. And now this is all open here. So this is the direction we're planning on going with the animals. So we can keep going back further. A few more trees are I downed here and pushed over so we can get along this this uh, property line right here just keep going up that way make some paddocks for a change but look it's all sunny and nice open so much difference Really cool. I also did something for myself. And I don't know. Hopefully I'll get the wife out here to do something here as well. So I have to clean it up a little bit. But this is where I'm going to target practice shooting guns. and uh, So I'll dig all this bottom area out and clean it up and 
and build this up a little higher here to shoot at. So I already had it kind of semi going, but uh, this is what I intended on making was something dug in the ground. There's a hill regardless that goes up this way, but just kind of wanted to make it a little more legit. Kind of looking forward to using that. This poor thing. <clears throat> Gotta make sure she gets attention. I'm glad these two are... They, we, we knew that they would kind of end up hanging out together, but still hasn't been easy for her but out of all of them she was pretty independent compared to uh, some of the other goats those boys were really attached to their mom so I don't know how they're doing um, the, the home um, or the new owners actually said that they're doing pretty good and have been giving us pictures but uh, hopefully that's true, we'll see. But uh, they sure really like them a lot. And so they're very, very happy. And we knew they would be because they're really good goats. Then you have Skye with her two babies over here. Jade. Learn. Look at Minnie Sky. Does she look a lot like her mom or what? Cute, huh? We just really like this baby here. She's so cute. Sky, you really turned out to be a good mama. Her mom was so young when she got pregnant, so it was just kind of weird. She had a weird birth yeah the only thing about sky she has these frosted ears little mini just has a little white on her head a oh, man wherever sky goes mini's right there next to her Blackie kind of does her own thing a little bit, but for the most part, they're always by her. She's a good mom. Oh, love you, honey. It's crazy how quiet they are right now. Everybody's getting enough feed. That's good. I know those two other ones, Hazel and Willow, are pretty obsessed with the feed. They've rammed a lot, so nobody else can get it. She was always getting the raw end of the deal. But for the most part, it looks like they're all eating. That's a good sign when they're quiet. Can't hear any animals right now pigs either. It's really quiet. It's nice. Yeah, this rain sure is made everything green around here. It's really nice. So hope you enjoy the footage. We're expanding big time here and uh, my wife's really happy about it and I was able to get a lot done with the three-day weekend. So got a single day rate but was able to get the tractor staying here the whole weekend. So that's the cool thing about renting from these people. All right, I'll talk to y'all soon. Stay well.